So I got to. I don't know if I shared it in a video. I know I did a small clip for my family, but I put here some seeds and I cover them with potting soil. And I don't know. Let me see. Now I'm trying to establish what is weeds and what is um, flowers. I've never had flowers from seed. I typically would buy just a plant before. So I don't really know what they look like. This one I know that it's a sunflower because of the, I had sunflowers last year. So that's a lie. I did start from seed sunflowers last year. I think these are nasturtiums because there's another one here, there's another one, there's another one over there. I'm kind of comparing it with the other weeds that are on the other side that is supposed to be here. <laughs> this one I'm not sure. I'm not sure what it is, but I'm pretty sure it's a weed. This ones again, I think they are nasturtiums. I'm sure it is because of the the leaves and how they look like. I was looking at the little packet, and I think that's what they look like. Now, this sunflowers are the the big ones. I think okay. that these are some variety of sunflowers. Um, it was a mix of sunflowers, so I'm pretty sure they're all sunflowers. So I'm gonna try to put the lavender, her tiny seeds, so I'm gonna little clumps and hope that some of them survive and this way I can have them mix with the nasturtiums and some flowers and kind of create a flower bed since the seeds are so tiny they just need a little bit of soil to cover them This is what it looks like. I'm gonna put a couple of logs around it to make more of a permanent garden bed because it's kind of spreading in some places. But at least I weeded and I added a little bit more soil. I think they need water, but since it's been raining, I'm gonna wait until later tonight. And if it doesn't rain too much, then I'll water them. Hoping for a bunch of sunflowers over here. We'll see what we get. In this garden bed for the tomatoes. Actually, I have four that are the same size. And I was thinking putting six tomato plants like I did last year. But they are taking forever to sprout. And... Um, I thought, well, I better put something on the ground and I better just get planting. And I'm gonna do this pickling the company Territorial Seeds and it's the Alibi F1, which is supposed to be done in 50 days. And it's pickling again. So I'm gonna give that a try. But before I start planting, I'm gonna get rid of all the weeds.
enough kisses? Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! <laughs> Go play! So I did four square feet and then here in the center I put two seeds. I'm gonna cover them. I'm gonna do a little experiment. I'm gonna do nine bush beans per square feet so I have two extra square feet here in the same garden bed. I am trying to grow as much food in the least amount of space um, possible so I'm gonna do nine and nine which is gonna be 18 plants of bush beans and this I think they're called cannellini or something like that they're red kind of kidney beans so over there I'm gonna leave that cucumber and over here i'm gonna do the the bush paint so we'll see what happens and i guess we'll figure it out in a few months Just a thin layer so they can sprout. Whoa! She's taking a dip in the creek. So in this one I'm gonna do nine bunging onions per square feet uh, I think it's four maybe it's gonna be eight square feet this one and the one thing that made me wait the most about the onions is that they're supposed to come back every year so I wasn't sure where to commit for them but it, it's gonna be here and if it ever needs to change then I will change and I will plant more 
but for right now this is going to be the one garden bed with all the bunging onions and since we have mild winters here hopefully we can keep eating uh, green onions throughout the winter So in this one, I think I'm gonna do winter squash and I'm gonna do banana. They're like a small variety of the banana squash. What are you eating, Hope? No. What are you eating, mommy? You cannot eat raw. Stop it. Hopey, get down. Get down from the garden. Get down. this one what I did is I did one more pickling cucumber and now in this two square feet that I have left I'm gonna do carrots I do have some that I started from seed but I still want to do some seeds because it's 16 per square feet so I won't have enough starts to start a whole entire square foot but um, I still want to get the carrots going so I'm gonna do some seeds as well. 